Hey, happy holidays, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and all of that kind of stuff. Now, for us in the construction industry, wintertime is typically the time of year where things start slowing down a little bit, and all the business owners out there start thinking about marketing. They're like, okay, things slowed down, but my guys still need work. How can I get more customers? How can I get control over this process of getting more customers? That's like the golden question, right? Because if you can control sales and get new customers whenever you want, then you can grow your business to whatever size that, you, that pleases you. So this is the time of year where people start uh, looking at lead reselling companies like Home Advisor and Angie's List, House, Porch, uh, who else? Yelp does it. Uh, Thumbtack, there's just so many of them now. There's, I swear, there's a new one every day. And they start looking at these companies thinking maybe this is the answer. Maybe this is the way that I can get more customers and be able to grow my business and not have to deal with this problem every year. Um, well, before you go hire these companies, let's just talk about what they are. So what, what is a company like HomeAdvisor? Well, a company like Home Advisor is really just a marketing company, uh, except they do marketing for themselves. See, they've figured out how to create a website and get homeowners to come to this website and reach out to Home Advisor in order to meet a contractor. And so Home Advisor has placed themselves right in between the consumer and the producer. And then Home Advisor takes a nice little cut out of that. So, how does Home Advisor get these customers? Well, they've all they've done is figured out how to make their website show up on top of Google for people searching for home services all over the United States, and I guess in Canada now too. So, if you go to Google and you pretend that you're looking for a plumber, and you type in plumber in my city. Uh, let's just say Post Falls, Idaho. Plumber in Post Falls. You're gonna be greeted with a screen that shows you a list of websites, a list of search results. And most likely, Home Advisor is gonna be right there at the top. And then you'll see Angie's List and Porch and Thumbtack and House and Yelp. And you'll see all these lead reselling companies, marketing companies really, showing up. You won't see nearly as many actual plumbers, which blows my mind. And so why is that? Well, it's because companies like Home Advisor are able to spend millions of dollars per year making sure that they show up on every freaking Google search everywhere. And they've put themselves They've inserted themselves in between the consumer and the producer, and that's their business model. Besides that, they really don't add very much value to the equation. So what does that mean for you as a business owner? Well, let's just look at a company like mine. I own a remodeling company, and we've been around for over 20 years. And we actually used to use Home Advisor and Angie's List. I've tried House, Yelp, Thumbtack. You know, I've tried just about all of them. But we used Home Advisor for like a decade. And we eventually stopped because their prices kept going up and the quality of the leads they gave us kept going down. And what we did was, this was around the time that I started my marketing company, which is why you're here on my website in the first place, because I'm also a marketer. I started this marketing company and I learned how to show up on Google above companies like Home Advisor, And that's really all it took. If you do a Google search for a bathroom remodel in my city, I pop up number one. I'm in the first spot. Home Advisor is somewhere else down on the page, and I'm sure Angie's List is there, and Thumbtack, and all the other ones. Uh, Home Advisor still pays for ads to be found on Google, but I've made sure that I show up before them, and that's all I had to do. My website brings in uh, at least five super high quality leads every single week. 
Uh, we close about one out of every five uh, sales. So we have way more leads than we could possibly need for a remodeling company. We can only handle a couple projects a month. So we end up turning most people away or raising our prices to the point where people kind of weed themselves out. But back to the topic at hand, which is your business, okay? If you aren't already taking advantage of having, being able to have a website, being able to have a free Google Maps listing, and just have your business be found on Google, then you aren't ready to use companies like HomeAdvisor or do uh, advertising like Google Ads and Facebook Ads and you know all the other marketing methods there are out there. Really, starting with the basics of having a website and a Google listing is essentially like having a business card these days. You know, in the old days, that's all you had was a business card. There wasn't uh, there wasn't internet, but you had a reputation. Maybe you had uh, some ads in the yellow pages. You had a billboard. Who knows? But this day and age, your website and your Google listing is the equivalent of your business card. So if you don't have these things in proper order. Uh, representing your company in a professional way, then you're just missing out on all these customers. And if you do have this stuff in order, this is the real kicker because I meet so many business owners that you know, they need high volume, they're trying to grow their business, so they are doing anything and everything they can think of. And they've bought a website and they invest in SEO and they pay a bunch of money every month for Google Ads. And they're also paying HomeAdvisor and Angie's List. And the thing that gets me is if you are paying for Google Ads and you are paying HomeAdvisor, you are essentially paying HomeAdvisor to compete, to, to advertise your competitors and compete with you, <laughs> with, the, with the other things you're doing. And it just boggles my mind how these companies are still around. But you know, they are on the down, they're going downhill quick. And you can tell because of the shady sales tactics that HomeAdvisor uses now. They call me all the time and they pretend to be a homeowner or a customer. And they even go out of their way to lie about who they are. Look, they call me from the same numbers all the time. I know who it is. And they ask the same kind of questions every time. They, I pick up the phone, they say, hey, do you do remodels? And if they're calling that specific number, the only place they can find it is on my website or my Google listing. So if they're on there, they know I do remodels. That's why they're calling. So to have them ask that is a dead giveaway of who it is. But they lie and they, they try to get around the fact that they're a salesperson. And that just shows me that they don't have anything of value to add. Otherwise, they wouldn't have to beat around the bush. They would just tell me how valuable they are and I would be happy to buy it but that's just not the case. So the reason I'm telling you all this is because obviously if you're here, uh, you're considering, you're either using these lead reselling services already or you're thinking about doing it. And over the last four years since writing this article, it's become nothing but more clear to me that these companies are not worth your time as a business owner unless you have already taken advantage of all of the other online marketing strategies and you really need high volume and you have a sales team that is capable of weeding through all the muck and the, you know, the majority of crappy leads that you get from it to pull out those gems. The only people I've ever talked to that have success with HomeAdvisor are the ones that have super high volume and they're able to just weed through it. So I just wanna let you know these things and point out to you that companies like mine and companies like yours would do a lot better to just make sure you have a professional website, make sure you're showing up on Google and make sure you're doing everything you can to improve your customer's experience when dealing with you online. And that for 99% of the companies out there that is all you need to do to be as successful as you want getting customers online. So I hope this message finds you well. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, if you read through this article and you have other questions, feel free to reach out to me. I'm happy to help. And if you have questions about how this other marketing works, just reach out to me. I'm, I'm happy to assist you. I'm happy to let you know anything that I know. I'm an open book. I put out videos all the time. I write 
articles about this stuff. Uh, this is my life's work. This is my passion, helping business owners like you figure out this internet thing once and for all so you can just get customers, get to work providing awesome services for your clients. Thank you and have an awesome day.